This is Rap Son, worshiping the Most High God of Israel alone and carrying on the legacy and teachings of my dear father and our dear messenger, Rap the News. You're looking at Planet Hell, a fire created to burn those who reject the Most High God of Israel, the one, the true God. That tiny dot right there is the sun, and that big fiery glow above it, that's your ass, Christians. GMS, ISUPK, IUIC, and the rest worshiping Christ crucified. How are you worshiping and expecting to be saved by a God who couldn't save himself? What a weak ass God. I am sticking with the Most High God of Israel alone, who is going to burn you and your false God for eternity. There is no God besides the Most High God of Israel. Isaiah 45, verse 5 through 6. Fuck yo, Yahweh Shai. Israel, you are looking at the destroyer, Jeremiah 4 7. What appears to be the wings are the debris tails of this planet, carrying millions of meteorites to destroy the nations. The ancients, they have depictions of it. And look in these depictions. They're at war, aren't they? Ain't they on the brink of war right now? Wake up, we close, Israel. We need to take these days of repentance seriously and most definitely the Day of Atonement. Not sinning or even contemplating on doing sin. You need to be cleansed so you have a chance of avoiding being melted in the furnace of affliction. Ezekiel 22 verse 20 through 22. And being pierced through like an enemy by the Most High. Jeremiah 30 verse 11 through 15. Planet Hell appears in Tokyo, Japan, showing off its lava pits as it sits on the horizon. As a warning to the Gentile nations of their impending doom and retribution for how they treated Israel. But wait, there's more! The meteorites make an appearance over New York City. This is a sign and a warning to the nations, but as well as Israel. He told you to flee the cities because the cities are going to be destroyed. You have to obey the Most High God of Israel. If he said flee, that means flee. He's going to destroy the cities with an overflowing rain of great hailstones, fire, and brimstones. As he stated in Ezekiel 38 verse 22, the Most High is not mocked and he's not a liar. If the Most High says he's going to do something, he's going to do it. If he say flee, that means flee. Some of you niggas are so afraid to leave the cities because you're going to lose your creature comforts. We you really going to be afraid when the Most High sends those meteorites to pierce you through. So, I had a dream a while ago that the planet appeared and it flew by. And when it flew by the first time, it sent down meteorites. Just a few to hit certain locations. But the next time when it circled back around, then it sent down a countless amount. They were just hidden everywhere. So you have in Pakistan, a meteorite coming down. And then you have a meteorite coming down in Finland. And then you have a meteorite coming down in Texas. And then countless others that's coming down but they're starting to fall slowly. Pretty soon, Israel, the Most High is gonna unleash his fury. You see in the planet, you see in the meteorites, you see in the war, you see the famine happening, you see him trying to make you take that mark. What's it gonna take to wake you up? This is Rap Son.